Hey everyone, Philaris here with the Gwen Jungle Clear Guide. Gwen Jungle's been popping up in both competitive play and high ELO solo queue lately, so I wanted to give a quick update to my Gwen Jungle Clear Guide. Start with your Q rather than your E, as it is faster after the E nerfs a few patches back. If you want to, you can open by hitting the Blast Cone to gain one snippy stack in advance, but to be honest, it doesn't really make a difference. E over the wall to Krugs at level 2, and focus down the big Krug. If you're having trouble hitting your sweet spot on both Krugs, I recommend aiming your Q slightly upwards. Try to kite in a circle around the big Krug to avoid taking damage from the medium Krug. Once the Krug splits, start spacing your autos out between the medium Krugs. Prioritize using your Q off cooldown so that it comes up again as soon as possible. Try to make sure that you kill the last two medium Krugs at about the same time, so that you don't have to worry about one set of little Krugs resetting first. E into Raptors, and auto-attack each one separately, using your Q once you have 3-4 snippy stats. You only need one auto-attack on each little Raptor, and then you can focus the big one down before finishing the camp with the second Q. E over the wall onto Wolves, and auto-attack a few times before using your Q. Similar to Raptors, you only need one auto-attack onto each little wolf. Focus the big wolf down, and then turn onto the blue buff. Prioritize using your Q off cooldown, as the finish timer on the blue Gromp double camp is gated by your Q usage. If you want to preserve extra HP, you can lightly kite blue and Gromp during the double camp as shown. Gwen doesn't have the healthiest first clear, so it's important to preserve HP wherever you can. If you're new to her, I recommend taking a flat armor shard rather than scaling HP like I did in this video. Thanks for watching, and feel free to subscribe. You can find a link to my Discord server in the video description below, and as always, a big thank you to my Patreon supporters for helping to make this channel possible.